Hey everybody, Travis Holes and White Food Force of Abundance, Minnesota, and I'm gonna be just uploading a pretty unique video today, kind of out of ordinary, but I thought it'd be fun. I ran out of mayo, mayonnaise, mayonnaise, and normally I have I use Japanese mayo. I don't know if you ever tasted Japanese mayo before, but if you haven't. You gotta try it. It's made by Q Pie. Uh, just look up Japanese mayo on Amazon and order it, man. I tell you what, once you taste that, that's the, the the only mayo you will use on anything. It's amazing. And but today I ran out of regular mayo. I cooked up a turkey uh, the other day, and now I have a bunch of meat left over. So I am chopping a lot up and gonna make a turkey salad or turkey spread. And I don't have any mayo. So I ran out, so I'm gonna make my own. I'm gonna make some homemade mayo. So this video here is how to make mayonnaise, mayonnaise. And I've never done this before, so it's gonna be kind of interesting to see what happens. But uh, basically the recipe is, uh, Okay, four ingredients. I'm adding a couple of things of my own because I gotta, because it's mine and I don't do anything per the instructions. I always gotta try to add my own little taste. So, it's supposed to take five minutes, makes one cup of mayo. So, two eggs, two large eggs, two teaspoons of lemon juice or vinegar it says freshly squeezed lemons i'm sorry i don't have those and my lemon trees upstairs are just starting to flower again so it's going to be about six to eight months before i have lemons up in my bedroom again um spare room and then a one cup of neutral flavored oil which is light olive oil grapeseed oil walnut or sweet almond oil what I did is I mixed half olive oil and half grapeseed oil and then a pinch of fine grain sea salt and I have some of this red sea salt here. I'm also going to add a little bit of garlic salt and garlic powder because I love, I love garlic. Garlic always adds the most amazing flavor to everything. So that's what I'm doing. So. Let's see what happens. Here we go. So, oh, let me let me just read this before I just jack this all up. All right. So, a wire whisk. I'm not doing that. And I'm not going to separate them out. I'm using a whole egg. All right. And then you do the oil a little bit at a time. A little water. All right, I'm using this food processor right here. So let's see what happens. All right. So we're going to start out adding these eggs. Just throwing the sink here. Excuse me. Let me get a fingers off and then we got the two tablespoons of lemon or two teaspoons of lemon juice I would rather have some freshly sliced or squeezed lemon because that tastes so good especially on lemons that you grow yourself they taste nothing like you get at the store trust me they're amazing and then we're gonna do our pinch of we're put, using pink Himalayan sea salt. And then we're going to put a little bit of garlic salt and garlic powder. And now we're going to see what happens. We're going to add a little bit of oil. Start this up.
really exciting, I know. Really exciting to watch the food processor, you know. Let's see what happens here. I think my mayo is going to be yellow because of the egg yolks. But let's see what happens. <laughs> Starting to thicken up, it looks like. We'll see. Let's see what happens. Oh, let's see. It's starting to thicken up. You're fucking kidding me. Wow. <laughs> that is crazy. But I think I need to add a little more salt. Let's see, a little salt. Maybe another little touch of garlic. But, wow, that's crazy how. All right. Well, it's that good. I, I know I need to thicken it up a little more. So we'll figure that out in a sec. But for the first time doing it, if I separated out the, the egg whites from the yolks, it would be completely white and probably more fluffy. But I really don't give a shit about that because I'm just going to mix it up with some turkey I'm chopping up and it's all going to be mixed together. Or put on sandwiches, put on crackers, whatever you want. But uh, there you go. That's how easy it is to make mayo. And I think the video says eight minutes, but I talked for a lot of it. And but so take took so five minutes to make it. That's that. Have a good one. Merry Christmas, everybody.